Nicholson sat down for a rare interview with The Sun and explained that his memory is totally fine. Instead, he chalked up the reason for his absence to simple boredom with the whole movie star thing, saying he was enjoying the retired life. Nicholson sat down for a rare interview with The Sun and explained that his memory is totally fine. Instead, he chalked up the reason for his absence to simple boredom with the whole movie star thing, saying he was enjoying the retired life. Okay, so lots of problems here. The son, a lot of people wrote like his son, S-O-M, chalked up, killed almost everybody. Again, this was a really tough one. Great phrasal verb. Uh, boredom, yeah, lots of little, little problems. But Nicholson sat down. Okay, this is also a great phrase, to sit down and do something. Nicholson sat down for a rare... It doesn't necessarily mean he sat in a chair, by the way, this expression. But Nicholson sat down for a rare interview. The T was gone. For a rare interview with The Sun. The Sun is a newspaper, okay? Nicholson sat down for a rare interview with The Sun and explained that his memory is totally fine. So all these sounds kind of go together, right? Explained that DTH are similar. Explained that this N is a strong sound. So the faster we say it, that TH gets weak. Explain that, explain that with the sun, with the sun, and explain that with the sun, and explain that, again, in Seinfeld, we're going to talk a lot more about cancellation and blending and things like that, uh, but it happens here too. Uh, with the sun, and explain that his memory is totally fine, totally fine. Instead, he chalked up A-W pronunciation. There's no L. The L is silent. Chalked up, chalked up. This word alone, chalked with a T, okay? But when we link this D, even though isolated, it's a T, chalked, when we link it, it changes back to a D, chalked up, chalked up. Instead, he chalked up the reason for his absence to simple boredom. Instead, he chalked up the reason to simple boredom. Instead, he chalked up the reason for his absence to simple boredom. Okay? To simple boredom. Not simply, uh, which would work, to simple boredom. With the, and what is the boredom of? With the whole movie star thing. And some of you wrote, put a hyphen here. I'll accept that. I like that. I didn't. Uh, but yeah, that's possible. With the whole movie star thing. With the whole movie star thing. Saying he was, he was enjoying, he was enjoying the retired life. Okay? I'm going fast, so please let me know if you have questions. Two times. Nicholson sat down for a rare interview with The Sun. Okay, The Sun is a newspaper. I think it's a British newspaper, right? Um, and he sat down. He doesn't do many interviews, but he did. He sat down. He took the time. So to sit down can literally mean to sit down, but it also means to take the extra time. So kind of a relaxed environment, no stress. He took the extra time to do a rare interview with The Sun and explained that his memory is totally fine, no problem. Instead, he chalked up the reason. He said his reason for his absence. To chalk up the reason, to chalk it up, means just to write it down, to write it down on the chalkboard. That's the idea. He chalked up the reason for his absence to, why? Simple boredom. Why was he absent? He was bored. He was simply Bored. The reason was simple boredom. Now, when we say bored, we like to use the word with or from. So in this case, with. What was he bored with? Ah, uh, the whole thing. What thing? The movie star thing. Ah, uh, being a movie star. Boring. Really? Saying he was enjoying the retired life. He's liked it. He was relaxing. 
Nicholson sat down for a rare interview with The Sun and explained that his memory is totally fine. Instead, he chalked up the reason for his absence to simple boredom with the whole movie star thing, saying he was enjoying the retired life. Nicholson sat down for a rare interview with The Sun and explained that his memory is totally fine. Instead, he chalked up the reason for his absence to simple boredom with the whole movie star thing, saying he was enjoying the retired life.